So, Warwick's new single, Horseman, uh, is disconnected from his uh, LP uh, or anything he's released in the past. It's a rock song that takes on some of the same elements of rock shown in um, his LP. Can you, uh, can, sorry, can we expect to see uh, some of these songs like this on the next LP? I think um, Horseman is really the standard for the kind of content on the next thing we release. Mm-hmm. Um Obviously, lyric-wise, it's more reflective of the times rather than being a fictional concept. Yeah. This this single's very present and written from a place of passion and, and anger. Yeah. But I feel like we want to use that energy and channel it into a coherent uh, project that we can continue to, like, just use that as a vehicle and soar into the next project with that rock element. Yeah, um... If I get my way, like I, I love, I love, love rock music. Like it's just rock with some elements of electronics, mm-hmm. and I, I feel like I, I really like Horseman just because it's, it's leading more into that rock sound. Yeah. What are your plans for the future in making music? Um, in making music. Okay, that's a bit more specific. I was thinking living. I'm not talking um, about your whole future, like your whole life. I'm just talking about <laughs> the, the side that I'm interviewing you for. I don't think we're able to really plan out anything right now, uh, just due to the way the world is. Mm-hmm. But I think if we had to decide on a plan, um, the closest thing we've had to one is work on some new songs, put out something, um, just kind of expand that reach. Because really it could be six or six hundred but as long as there are people that enjoy the music Mm -hmm. we're gonna be happy yeah and if we can get that music in front of 600 or 600,000 as we continue to expand Mm -hmm. that would be the end goal because really we just want to get those messages out to anyone who's gonna listen yeah yeah um i don't know if he wants me to say this but i'm looking forward to putting out a second album which is like we hope it's gonna be a bit you know, as we gain more experience, just a bit better produced, better mixed, better recorded. Yeah. Um, again, trying to get some more live elements in there, just because, like, I just love that sort of classic sort of rock feel, but with some new twists to it, like electronic element and such. Do you have any plans to incorporate uh, any of those bands that you've mentioned before, like sound, into your music? I think in terms of um, inspiration and incorporating elements from things we listen to, this next thing has, I'd say, some elements of the killers that I tried to take in terms of just the gritty vocals and I guess the way they kind of build up over the song and then return to elements throughout the album, which Luke really helped me... uh, understand and kind of pointed me towards when he got me into the killers there's another band called glass animals yes um, i've heard of them we're trying or at least i'm trying to incorporate a few elements of that kind of jungle cult vibe Mm -hmm. and just really get those ethereal electronic sounds mixed in with the live music so aside from the uh